you guys get it? Uh, anyway, <laughs> anyway, so let's do that ammonium ion now. Okay, so that one that we just drew in the last one. So NH4 plus. Okay, so if we think about the ammonium ion and it losing a proton, right? So this side overall is, what's the total charge of this side overall? Plus one, right? And overall already this side is what? Plus one. So can you add anything else to this? Any more numbers? No. So this thing has to be neutral, right? The thing that you're making here has to be neutral. Is everybody okay with that? So what's happened here, right? The electrons, electrons are negatively charged, right? So they are going, and this thing's going to be positively charged, right? So it's going to lose electrons, right? And this part here is going to be neutral, so it's going to gain electrons. Does that make sense to everybody? So we can think of, there's, what I'm doing is I'm showing you the second step to an acid-base mechanism, okay? But um, if you guys look at my, I look at the YouTube channel and like talk, look for acid-base, you can um, see what we're doing in other classes, you know, that might be a little more advanced, but stuff you could understand, do you know what I'm saying, it help you out, but anyways, so you can think of those electrons as moving like that, right, so when we do that, we take that, that negative charge off of there, so that's going to be, make that positive, right, that's what we get there, and we take those electrons and move them to there, so what do we have? Remember, how many electrons are in a bond? Two, right? So that nitrogen is going to have, still have its three other H's, but now it's going to have two electrons there. Okay. And nitrogen with three bonds and a lone pair is always neutral. So is that cool? Okay, so what, what, was, what was that question now? So, you were saying something about the equilibrium arrow, right? Yeah, so if there is, it is a possibility that the conjugate base could get its proton back, depending, remember Le Chatelier's principle, okay? So depending on if we add a lot of this, it'll make the reaction go that way, okay? So if we add a bunch of more acid, right, what'll happen is these electrons, We'll see that there's a lot of them, and they'll go and grab it back, like that, and then it goes to that. Is that cool? And, of course, we would get the ammonium ion back, or the acid, right? Does that make sense? Is everybody okay with that? Can I, uh, can I kill this video, or are there any questions? Okay.